Hi, Paul Addison, HealthQuest, back with your ACL prevention series. We're now going to go into a more of a dy dynamic hip stability exercise. I really like side to side hopping because a lot of people train straight front to back. The side of the hip muscles, however, control where your knee goes in space. So if these guys are weak or if you're just not in tune with what they're doing, your knee's going to be falling in every time you push and cut. So these are some great pushing and cutting exercises that we like to do. So I like to start off having the athlete go pretty flat and keeping it more of a quick plyometric side to side. We then progress them to more of a 45 degree arc. And then even more of a 60 degree arc as we really get up into it. A lot of body weight coming down. So trying to go that speed, even trying to go plyometrically where they just fly right off the ground. Good job. So all of these exercises are really for training the outer hip muscles and just the reactivity of that leg on the ground so that you can spring off and not have that knee falling inwards every time. This is about a one to two year progression though. So when you're working with your strength and conditioning coach, make sure that they're following that progression and getting you uh, the proper training. Uh, if you're in the Southern California area, we'd love to work with you. Go to hqphysicaltherapy.com and we'll uh, have a sign-up form there. Thank you.